Right now, I'm about to cut open Andrew's watermelon. I just cut up in three dragon fruit for me, and I'm gonna open this watermelon for Andrew. Whoa, I'm so excited for Andrew. We're gonna put a little bit of lime juice on top. It helps with digestion and helps to not get the melon belly. So we're just gonna put a little bit of that on. I mean, obviously it's still a mono meal, like the lime juice won't do like much to the watermelon, but like it looks pretty good. It looks pretty dang good. I think it's gonna be a good one for Andrew. I might have a little bite too. Oh my gosh, Andrew's gonna be so happy right now. I know he's gonna be blissed out. He's so excited to eat, you don't understand. This has been a really great experience for him. I know, like, he's been really appreciative of the experience, but he's like, I need eating in my life. That's one of the things that he's working on. That's our, we're trying to get our GPS to work, so it's talking at us. Um, but anyway, so I'm gonna get some lime juice, and then maybe, we'll, maybe we will be able to document Angie's first bite. I think that that's gonna be in our future here, so anyway. Keep eating whole foods again. Been on this fast now, and um, today's day 41. So I am going to be on camera as I taste my first bite of food. Give me a nice fresh watermelon that Melissa prepared for me, and a little bit of lime juice squirted on top to help with digestion. And so I'm really excited for this and. Obviously, since I haven't eaten for 40 days now, I'm going to take it nice and slow and chew slowly and just be mindful of my own body and how I'm reacting to this food. But I'm so, I'm gonna like just smell it for a second. Mm. Smells like watermelon. <laughs> Smells really good. Definitely. How does it feel to be chewing again? Very strange. I'm used to like chewing my own teeth. Well, not chewing my own teeth, but just like, like biting and there's nothing there. Like that. <laughs> One of my favorite things on the fast was, was coconut oil pulling, because I could actually like taste the coconut oil, even though I wasn't swallowing it. And it's like a comfortable feeling because it's pure fat. Of course, there's no fat in here, which is good. I'm not ready for fat yet, but. Less lime juice? Um, so pretty limey. Hmm. Is it a good watermelon? It's, it's pretty good. It's not the best. Yeah. Think, but it's pretty good. Very juicy. Mm. 
All right. Well, I think we'll sign off and let you enjoy the rest of that watermelon. It's wonderful. So this week I'm gonna be eating melons, mostly watermelon, maybe a honeydew or cantaloupe if I'm lucky. And then the week after, I guess starting Monday of next week, I will start to eat more varieties of fruits with a salad, a light salad in the evening. So I'll keep you tuned to how I'm doing. Thanks for watching. And I'm finally at the end of my day, about to go to sleep. And just wanted to recap. Today, I enjoyed what is the equivalent of about one whole large watermelon. I really had two mini watermelons. And I also had the equivalent of two whole limes with those watermelons. And I also had just roughly a cup of dehydrated prunes that were rehydrated with water and soaked for a while. So um, I feel really good and I, let's see, I had a bowel movement around a little after noon time, around one o'clock or so. And I weigh right now about 118 pounds and that's after eating all the food I had today. And I would, I would estimate that I was probably about three pounds lighter before, uh, at the beginning of today, so before I started eating. And um, here you can get just a little picture of, um, of what, it, what it is that I eat roughly. And that background noise is our beautiful sprout maker making some wonderful alfalfa sprouts. You can see it going for Melissa so she can add to her salads. Back to this here you can see the breakdown here of percentages. So I put in in chronometer that I want to be eating in 80% uh, uh, carbohydrates, 10% protein, and 10% fat, which is what I, roughly what I believe is optimal. And you can see the total calories for today. We're under 2,000, um, and that's, I think, yeah, I just, I felt good, I felt full both times I ate, and um, feeling good heading into the second day, so, um, yeah, I'm planning to eat some soaked dates tomorrow, and some more um, melon, probably some cantaloupe, if it's ripe, we'll see. And and might even bring a meal of oranges tomorrow. We'll have to see. But I'm I'm sticking to mono meals, of course, and uh, sticking to fruit for the first week. So yeah, I'm feeling good. All right, good night.